A new documentary is premiering this week. It looks at the role of racism in U.S. healthcare. News 12's Frank Recchia caught up with the filmmaker who lives here in Connecticut. The Deadliest Disease in America, a documentary examining the role of racism in U.S. healthcare, offers up an unsparing examination through the eyes of patients and healthcare professionals of what they describe as fundamental inequities in the system. By a show of hands, who really believes that racism exists in healthcare? <laughs> racism is not always overt. It can be very subtle. It can be how you're treated. The documentary is the latest project from critically acclaimed filmmaker Crystal Emery, who lives in Connecticut. I was on CBS a few weeks ago, Mission Unstoppable. Oh, Crystal, yeah. who happens to be a quadriplegic, produced and directed the film over the course of a decade, saying her goal is to bring greater awareness to disparities in American health care due to racism and to start a wider conversation about the topic so that true change can be made. We then have to take action. And what does action look like? It looks like you. It starts with the individual, because individuals make institutions. Crystal, who's known for her warm personality, says she's proud to bring to the table experience as an author, STEM, and healthcare advocate. I really don't like the word disabled, because there's nothing dis about me but I am differently able. In fact, I don't know what to do if I see something that I think is biased or discriminatory. A filmmaker with an uncontainable spirit asking tough questions about the disease of racism and hoping her candor will help contribute to a cure. What we are doing with the film is opening people's eyes just a little bit more so that we touch their heart. Frank Recchia, News 12, Connecticut. I love the way she says, there is nothing dis about me. The Deadliest Disease in America, premiering Friday at Cinema Village in New York City.